Hey guys, let's go back in from that last video you just saw. I'm going to explain what the hell I was driving. Well, it's a Kyosho FW05T Plus frame with a GXR15 engine. Uh, the yellow body used to be white, was running, but after one of the first accidents I ever had, it had no bumper in the front end left. So I went, bought a clear body. I built my own frame, it's Silverado. I don't know, it looks good. Considering it's a custom paint job by yours truly. And this is the car. Two channel Kyosho um, receiver and transmitter. Works well. Like for, considering it cost me 350 Canadian, and that's complete ready to go except for the gas. Runs well. I cracked the gas tank once, I snapped a front, um, what do you call it, drive line. Snapped one of them, I have gone through about four glow plugs. Not much else, I upgraded the air filter. The old air filter used to be one of those just sort of open-ended. Uh, where is it? Ow. Oh, there it is. It's one of these. It worked, but I uh, wanted more performance. I don't know if I got much more, but uh, yeah, it works. Changed out the pull line for the pull start. I haven't gone with electric start since this was my first nitro vehicle. It's not really worth it for the moment. But it runs well. For the most part, I haven't had a hard time tuning it. When I first got it, I had a hard time, but it's because I had no idea how to do this stuff. But um, after that, she went well. I would suggest this tiny one. If anyone wants to buy cheap and, sorry, inexpensive vehicle, Kyosho makes pretty good vehicles. HPI sort of makes more of the higher end stuff, but I'll be going with HPI probably for the bigger nitro truck or the truggy. I don't know, we'll see in the future how it goes. Fortunately with work I won't be able to do any of that. It's hard enough keeping this thing running. I have that much fuel left. And then after that, who knows. I may buy some more, but we'll see. Hopefully I don't crash it. I had a good time outside. It got a bit wet, just cold. Tires do not stick. They're so bald. Wait, it's the way they came, sorry. <laughs> they come uh, slicks, but they're the first tires that came with it. Sort of that mag look. And then the second pair of tires that I bought, which have gone through, I think, two sets, are these foam tires. It worked well, but uh, I ate the back tires because I was constantly sliding out the back end and having some fun. Oh, well, it's fun sport. I mean, fun uh, hobby. I also have, I don't know where the bag of stuff went, but uh, this big block of, oh, block of sheets of foam and a bag of parts. Oh, right here. This will soon become an airplane I'm supposed to build in the summer. I don't know where the plans are, but uh, a lot of expensive parts here. This charger was 170 bucks. That's for the special batteries that they use. By the way, don't drop those batteries. They tend to explode if you do. <laughs> I've seen pictures of airplanes. If you want to see that, uh, I wonder if I can find a video. I even have battery that I should destroy because it's finished. Maybe that's another video I can do. Exploding lipo batteries. Anyways guys, talk at you later.